Mr. Palmasano. Yes, Mr. Speaker, my colleagues, I have the privilege to introduce Cadet Lily Rowland. Uh, Cadet Rowland is uh, a freshman plebe at West Point. She's from Corning, New York, uh, which I happen to live in Corning, New York, so it makes me especially proud. She's the parents of Mr. and Mrs. Kenneth and Jennifer Rowland. She was a 2014 graduate, graduate of Corning East High School. She's uh, majoring in environmental engineering and participating in women's rugby at West Point. Uh, after her high school graduation, she attend, attended Binghamton University and played soccer there, and then she attended the Marion Military Institute, which pre uh, provided a prep school training for West Point. Uh, I know uh, Cadet Ruland's parents well, uh, and service is certainly in their family. Her dad, Ken, uh, currently serves as an investigator in the New York State Police and also served four years in the United States Army. And her mom also served as the uh, district director, D director of constituent services uh, for the 23rd Congressional District at one point. Lily is the oldest of four children. Uh, she has three other sisters, Rose, who's a senior at Corning High School, Grace, a junior, and her youngest sister, Poppy, is in seventh grade. And Poppy, I know from part of the swim club with my son and daughter. I spoke to uh, her former superintendent of Corning High School and uh, Mr. Janowski said, oh, Lily was a great student, a great athlete, and highly respected by the faculty. And I also had the privilege to talk to her dad today, and I said, is there any message you'd like to, uh, like me to say uh, to, to Lily today? And he goes, yes, please tell her that uh, we love her, uh, we're proud of her, and we'll see you soon. Uh, Cadet Rulin, uh, we thank you. And please know that it's not just your uh, your mom and dad and your family that are proud of you, that your hometown of Corning is proud of you, but all of us in this chamber, all of us in New York State and this great country are so proud of you and all your cadets for your commitment, your dedication, and service to put your country ahead of yourself, the safety and security and the freedoms of its citizens is uh, such a noble calling and honor, and we can't thank you enough. So, Mr. Speaker, please welcome Cadet Ruin. Uh, to the chamber uh, today. Thank you. Certainly, on behalf of Mr. Palomasano, the Speaker, and all the members, we welcome you here to the New York State Assembly, to the People's House. We extend to you the privileges of the floor and our hopes for your uh, great future that you will have. Thank you so very much for being with us.